Hey baddie besties, welcome back. If you don't know me, my name is Rhonda and we do subscription box unboxings here. Today we have the Halloween Deco Crated Box, an FX Crate box, which is supposed to be Halloween makeup and sticker savages. So let's get started. <music> So the Deco Created Halloween box just came in and it is $39.99 a month. So Deco Created has their usual subscription of $79.99 a quarter, but now they just started with the Halloween box, a holiday box that they'll sell for $39.99. So everything in here should be Halloween themed. Let's find out what we've got. I haven't seen anybody open any of these yet, so I really don't have any idea what's in here. Okay, we got a little envelope, cute. So it still comes with the little card, Hocus Pocus. It's just a bunch of Hocus Pocus or trick or treat. It's a little bit of decoration there. And then your thank you letter and apparently some things that might be in the box. So let's find out which of these things is in the box. So this is the inside as usual. It says recycle today for a better tomorrow, box made from recycled material. That makes me happy. All right, we've got some Halloween pillowcases or a pillowcase. Super cute. Ah, very Hocus Pocus movie themed. I put a spell on you and now you're mine. Very excited to put that on my couch. I love that movie. I love this. Okay, so three of these came in a box. This one says, Potion number 31, Witch's Brew. We've got Eye of Newt, premium quality, bottled on October 31st, 1883, which I didn't notice. This one has that too. Natural Ingredients, premium quality. And Moon Dust, store under the light of the moon. These are super cute. I love these. I am loving this stuff. It's going to be really easy to keep this up and put it away. Very cute little wooden decorations. I'm loving everything so far. Oh, this is great. Put your little candle in there and it'll light up the room. Probably put little glowing lights all over your house. Oh, awesome. Okay. A big one and a little one. I love that. Okay. So... Now I'm super sad that I missed my opportunity to order the Christmas box because I haven't been paying enough attention to my emails. But I I love this. I love everything that I got, especially this pillowcase. It makes me want to just walk around singing. <laughs> so if you haven't seen me open up a decorated box before, they package everything really well. I've never... I'm sure there have been issues in the past some with somebody else, but I've never had an issue with anything being broken or needing to be replaced. So next up is Sticker Savages. Sticker Savages is $11.90 a month. You can get it on CrateJoy or the StickerSavages.com website. They send you 10 waterproof stickers curated by Instagram artists. They're limited edition stickers, so if you don't get them in this box, I don't know that you can get them anywhere else. And they donate 10% back to helping fight climate change. So let's check out what we've got. Okay, so they send you this card that lets you know who the Instagram artist is so that you can follow them if you really like the art. I do put this on our Instagram and I do list the artists that these were made from so that you can check them out yourself. Um, so let's see if I can't mash these up. This is at Doodles and Drips. He's got a lot going on. I guess he's hungry. <laughs> uh, let's see. This one is at John Speaker. I like that one a lot. I'm a simple person, I guess. Here is at Brad Albright, A L B R I G H T. But again, you can go check out the Instagram page. This one is at Chris Shiner Art. I feel like it's one where you pull it away and you'll see something maybe in a different way. Obviously, it has its particular way to face. 
very Gemini-like with the dual face. This one is at Cat Dirty, a little gory for Halloween. I feel like all of these stickers were perfect for Halloween, so I wanted to open it up. This is like a whole Halloween-themed box opening. This one is at Falk underscore art, F-A-L-K. I like the aliens. I always like the aliens. Oh, he's got owls on his shoulders. That's interesting. Good night. <laughs> this one's really cool. It's at Egg Zoo, but I like the knight riding on a seahorse. That's very creative. This one is at Luke underscore Schroeder underscore art. And I definitely think that this is one where you can maybe get a different image depending on the light or the way it's facing, you know, whichever way. And the last one in the box is at Cure Art, K-U-R-A-R-T. Very cool little skeleton head. It was facing the wrong way when I first looked at it, but I love that. Anything along those lines is right up my alley. What do you guys think of that box? Do you like any of the stickers? Okay, so this last one is FX Crate. So it's supposed to be a themed, high-end, quality costume makeup, special effects makeup. It ships to the US and Canada, it's $24.99 a month, and they have online video tutorials and a community. I was hoping Haley would be here to open this one with me, but let's check it out. Okay, this is not exactly what I was expecting, but I don't know that much about special effects makeup. So it gives you a list of the makeup they sent you. It lets you know what's inside. That way, if anything's missing, you can let them know. It says, thank you for ordering our crate. Here's a list of items for this month's makeup. Please make sure to find every item. We have double checked your crate's contents to make sure that every item is there and ready for you to start creating. So, I thought there would be like maybe a little magazine or maybe like a piece of paper to just kind of or even just a picture of someone with the makeup on, with the theme, because, I mean, one of the reasons that I liked it is that it said, because one of the reasons that I liked it is because it said that it was themed, and yet I'm not seeing anything that says the theme. This just says student theatrical kit light slash fair. I don't know if they asked me my skin tone. I don't think they did. I got it on Crate Joy. But I'll show you what's inside. So we've got three of these little triangles to apply makeup with. One of these little ones that I believe you can dab and make it look like blood or scarring. I think I've seen that done. This is white face powder so I think that's enough to do quite a bit with okay this is theatrical cream foundation pro FX collection the brand here is graftobian graftobian G-R-A-F-T-O-B-I-A-N. I'll just leave that up. And let's see. All right, so it's got a screw top. And it's a pretty dark. I think I could do stuff with that. I thought this one was supposed to be a zombie bride of some sort. But I guess I could be wrong. A little white pad. A little brush. This is the Graftobian Dark Chocolate Eyeliner. Can definitely use that for a lot of things, not just the Halloween makeup. And I think actually I could probably use a lot of this for more than just Halloween makeup. This last thing is the Graftobian Professional Makeup. On here it says lining and contour shades four color palette, but as you can see, I've got five. So no complaints there. 
Okay, so it has the colors on the back. Uh, light highlighter, plum, deep mocha, warm blush, and nude. And they do tell you highlighter, contouring shade, contouring shade, cream rouge, and lip color. So I'm excited to get into that. I talked to Haley about maybe like doing a little video of us trying to do this makeup off of the tutorial. But I thought that the tutorial would come into the box and it did not. So I'm not disappointed. I mean, a little disappointed, but you can do the video tutorial online as it says. So I'm going to go online. I'm going to see if I can find out what this theme was. It would have been nice if they had at least put somewhere on here what the theme was. But there's not, from anything I can see, there's nothing stating what the theme of this box was supposed to be. So, and also judging from the makeup, I don't think it's like a zombie bride. But I could have misread that. Maybe it was supposed to be something else. And I don't know that they send the same thing in every single box. So, it could be that everybody gets a different theme. But it would be nice if they at least let you know what that theme was on some level. So what did you guys think of the box? I love that I was able to do a Halloween theme within the first week of October. That makes me super happy. Happy October. Uh, happy Breast Cancer Month. Happy Halloween Month. I am gonna check out Graftobian online as a brand to see what that generally costs in the store. So hopefully by the time this video comes out, I'll have some kind of information additional information written down below and obviously I'm going to put it up on Instagram and hopefully by then I'll know what the theme of the box was. I really liked all three of the boxes but let me know how you guys felt about the boxes and let me know if there's any boxes that you'd like to see on the channel down in the comments below and you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye!